Hello YouTube, welcome to another video by the Geo Scholar. For this video I'm going to focus on Greenland. This is Greenland. This is Greenland compared to the rest of the world. On this Gaul stereographic projection it looks like it's about the size of Brazil. Gaul stereographic projection. There's Greenland on this globe. And it looks markedly smaller. I've got my trusty Google Earth here and there's Greenland right there. Greenland looks markedly smaller compared to what was on my Gaul stereographic projection map. As you can see here on this Google Earth, Greenland looks like it's closer in size to Mexico, which is right there. One thing to understand about maps you have to understand distortion, you have to understand what's being represented. You're trying to represent something that is round, you're trying to represent the world. It's round and the way to represent that on a flat surface, you wind up with a lot of distortion. And on this particular projection, you have a lot of distortion towards the polar regions. Notice how big some of these places look. Right there around the Svalbard area, re the Svalbard region, get closer, Svalbard Island, Spitsbergen, and then you've got these other islands, Novaya Zemlya, Franz Josef Land, Severnaya Zemlya. You got these areas, and then you've got Ellesmere Island, Baffin Island. You've got a lot of these places that are being distorted at the poles. Look at Antarctica. You're going to have distortion on maps because you're trying to take something round. You're trying to take the Earth, and you're trying to represent it on a flat surface. And that is what I have to say about that. If you like this video, check out other videos on my channel. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe. 